Quinn has come a long way and training that we're doing is uh, mapping, digital mapping and we're creating our own maps and we're hoping to go back to country to um, learn how to do it within our organization and we'll share the knowledge to the rest of the crew back home. Yeah, well, we pick a photo and then on the map and then we edit it. We add dots in there and an area of our map and um, just little areas like the burial sites and waterways and campgrounds and yeah, just created all that stuff. So with doing the mapping course during this week, it is good because we're going to be qualified at the end of it. It's good to learn about mapping, QGIS. Um, especially when you're a ranger. We are learning how to put down on the maps about sites and how to add labels about different sites, add colours and editing names. You get a lot of training out of it and you get to meet new women rangers around the country. Um, I really would encourage women to get involved in a lot of training, especially with aerial drones and underwater drones. Um, it just gets you connected to country. Um, you can show it to your elders who can't go on country anymore. They're just too old to be there. Um, so yeah, it really, you can show your community the work that you do, um, your elders the work that you do, and yeah, it just gets everybody connected again. Yeah. Um, so I participated in a weaving workshop in Cairns, I think about 2020, with the Yalanji ladies. And um, the technique I found was really hard, so it kind of made me realise I need to learn my own. And um, went back to my auntie and, um, yeah, said to her, I need you to teach me. So she had to talk the process through with me and, yeah, I realised it was even more important that I pick it up because if I didn't, you know, other people are going to be... It's not going to be handed down the generations. And I guess hosting my first um, ever weaving workshop with the Queensland um, Indigenous Women Rangers, yeah. Uh, well, pending the grades from my exams last week, I should hopefully graduate in a week or two, so very excited. But I studied a Bachelor of Wildlife Science at UQ. With this, it's a great opportunity for me to see, I guess, what's out there work-wise. It's incredible. It's like this whole setup is beautiful, and just to learn about the currents, just everything that scientists are doing, and just not even science, like everyone, everyone's involved in here. It's just beautiful. They've done such a great job. So. One nature is open all over. Grab it strong and carry it with you. Uh, the number of us deadly women out here are getting bigger and it'd be great if we can grow Queen then put it out there. Australia wide, yeah. I think it's really important for what Quan has created but also the growth and to be able to have the ladies showcase um, that bonding and the relationships and the culture and also what they do every day. I recently had a biosecurity forum with rangers from all over Northern Australia and the big feedback that came from that was being able to share and have a safe place and feeling connections, um, traditional knowledge and cultures, um, sharing issues as well. Um, it's just the highlight was being able to connect everyone, showcase that not only within each other in ranger groups but also with departments as well and forming those new networks. Like as a weaver, I'd be really interested to see how other people weave, um, the materials, you know, the different tying techniques and stuff like that. I have come across other ranger groups, like through big networks, for example, the World Indigenous Network that happened in Darwin. And man, just the difference in the culture, because a lot of people just assume us First Nation people are just one. Whereas when we come across the different diversities of cultures within the First Nation people, yeah, it just blows me away and I'm always learning. Like, you know, people look at us First Nation people and think we're all the same. No, we're not. We speak different dialects, we live different countries. 
Yeah, it's just awesome. And if I mean, if we can do it here in Queensland, I can't see why we can't take it national. Oh, no.